What is going on everybody? Welcome to Stylish Grease Monkey. My name is Chris. I hope you're doing well. Today I want to talk to you about the 8 inch Thorogood boots. Here we go. You know, I try to wear boots all year round. It doesn't matter if it's six inch or eight inch or whatever it is. I just got out of the military. That is a requirement for me day in and day out to wear a pair of boots, so I'm used to it. Here in Hawaii, it's hot. Not a lot of people wear boots, so whenever there's a change in season, which believe it or not, we do have a change in season. I was told yesterday was the last day of summer and today, September or whatever 24 is the first day of fall and what that means here is more rain and the shift in weather a little bit to maybe cooler weather so I'll make that excuse to wear the 8 inch boots not that I don't wear it during summer but it's perfect time to do that so what about the Thorgood 8 inch boots here's what I have for you good made in the USA uh, they listen to the customers uh, what the customers are are those that work in the business of industrial right electricians construction workers all of these guys that actually do work so most of their shoes are geared towards heritage not only heritage but also geared towards those that work in those industrial or construction sites which means they're geared towards safety and reliability for the price of the boots, it is very highly competitive and also back up their claim that it is reliable. And I can tell you, I own a couple of Thor goods in the past and they last me a long, long time. So what about it tying up to Heritage? Well, Heritage, because this was created years back, much like uh, Red Wing, uh, to focus on those workers, right? Mining companies, uh, you know, electricians, the railroad workers, and things like that. So, um, to this day, they are rooted on those types of work, as you can tell by the materials they use. So, the one I have here I'm going to talk about is the 8 inch Thor Goods. It's the American Heritage Mokto 8 inch boots in oil tanned leather, oil tanned tobacco leather. And you can buy such thing right now in Amazon between 214 and 230. Uh, depends on where you buy it, but uh, brand new is about 230 bucks, let's just say, uh, plus shipping or whatever it is that you're gonna get. It's the 8044208 if you wanna purchase it exactly the same. Now they have different, again, they have different models, so you make sure you, you look at it. I love the color of this pair of boots. I love the way the uh, patina is setting in very nice pair of boots. The boots itself construction is very well I've done a review about the, of this boots a long time ago uh, Now I'm coming around to wearing it again So I want to talk about the construction of the boots the upper portion of the boots is very nice guys uh, Like I said, it is an oil tan tobacco Leather and the color is beautiful to the point where I don't want to actually get it dirty so I wear these boots only if I am riding my motorcycle that has a heel shifter and, a, and here's what I mean by that is that you, he, you shift using your heels so I don't damage the top of the boots. I use my red wings and my other boots for my, my other motorcycle that has the front shifter only but I like the heel shifter because it preserves the boots. Now the bottom of the boots is made out of this, uh, the outsole is made out of the Max Wear wedge outsole which is claimed to be grippy and uh, last 30% more or reliability. As far as comfort guys, out of the box, the spare boots right here is freaking comfortable. I did not have to do anything with it. It is very comfortable, wore it out right out of the box. Um, a lot of people are like, why do you wear boots in the summer here in in Hawaii well one is that that is my style again heritage style right 
As far as the size is concerned, you all know already that I go half an inch down from my sneaker sizes, which is I wear 12s on my sneakers, and then coming down to the boots 11 and a half, it's perfect for my feet, guys. I know some of you are probably wanting to go down an inch from your sneaker size, that's up to you, but I highly recommend that if you do that, find somewhere to buy these boots where you can return them uh, once you try them on so that you can exchange and get the right size for you. Don't buy a pair of boots from somebody that's uh, final sale or charges you with shipping. You know what I mean? Because that's going to cost you more and it's an ugly mistake. Now, if you have access to uh, a store, I would highly recommend just go in the store, wear the right socks at the time of the day, I would say midday to late of the day because uh, there's a tendency that our feet swell and go ahead and try those boots, walk around in the store with it for a, uh, a lengthy minute and then assess if this is the boots for you. Again, like I said, out of the box, very, very comfortable. Didn't have to have a break-in period with these pair of boots. Real quick, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and that notification bell so you know every time I upload a video, let's grow this channel together. It's growing slowly, but I am very sure that most of you that are hanging around love my videos, so I love you too. Thank you. Talk to you soon. And because for good keeps the workers in mind aside from the shoes being stylish nowadays and we use it for heritage style it is really purposely built for those that are workers right I know there's a few of you that are watching my videos that are actually working in the fields of industrial engineering you know construction and you use this pair of boots so this particular model right here has safety toes which means the steel steels underneath the toes so it's really good for uh, working on summer where there's a possibility of something dropping on the toes. That is the 8-inch Heritage Makto boots from Thorogood. I hope you like this video. If you don't, then do what you gotta do. But I hope you get something out of it and that I am influencing you to wear great things here, guys, as far as style. Find your style. And I hope that you find the heritage wear as your style and that I am making a positive impact on what you want to do with that. So that's all I have for you today. I'll talk to you again soon. Aloha.